No Moy, it's Joinin. Today we're taking a look at five weird websites. In reality, it will probably be more than five. This one is called Nobody Here. It seems to be in German. All right, there's English. <laughs> okay, English right here, let's swap to that. I'd like to apologize to all for this. Plant, what is this? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Dodo seems I... Pool is home to a Band-Aid. Flying is terrifying. Oh, what if I click it? Just when I thought I was over my fear of flying, my mother also sends her regards along with the other stewardess. What is going on here? I'm so confused. What are these? There are no new messages. I can't even read that. The, uh, to the kitchen for coffee. I don't know what's going on here. Uh, I think I'm just gonna move on to another website. <laughs> okay, so this one's called Superior Web Solutions. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what? <laughs> Let us be your webmaster. Uh, Superior Web Solutions is a- it's this? Home. Home. Contact. 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 Home. Wait, is this a real website? Is- is that what this is? We welcome your questions and encourage you to comment via email. I think this is someone's website, like this isn't like a joke. <laughs> Here are the ways we receive online payments. Pay now. Sure. What? Uh, no thanks. So this one's called Zombo. Welcome to Zombocom. This is Zombocom, and welcome to you who have come to Zombocom. Thank you. <laughs> Anything is possible at Zombocom. The infinite is possible at Welcome to Zombocom. Cool. Okay, well that's Zombocom. Hello, and welcome to my homepage. My name is Ulrich Harburst. And I like to write stories about Roy Orbison being wrapped up in cling film. <laughs> A joyous new development. I have published a Roy Inkling film novel. Alright, we'll check that out in a second. But uh, first of all, Roy Inkling film story one. It always starts the same way. I'm in the garden, airing my Terrapin Jetta. When he walks past my gate, that mysterious man in black. Hello, Roy, I say. What are you doing in Dusseldorf? Attending to certain matters, he replies. Ah, I say. He apprises Jetta's line with a keen eye. That is a well-groomed terrapin. Hold on, can we, terrapin jetta is at the, what is a terrapin? A species of turtle. I think that's a car. Is terrapin a color of jetta? But then he says that is a well-groomed terrapin. What? I am in the garden airing my terrapin jetta. So is it a turtle or is it a car? Why would you be airing either one of those? So speaking of weird websites, my new Patreon page. I decided I wouldn't make a Patreon until I hit 10,000 subscribers, but uh, I'm there now. I'm giving YouTube literally all of my time at the moment. And I think Patreon can be a really good way to help keep things sustainable until things really get rolling. So currently Patreon is the best way to support the show. And there's some little perks depending on the tier, but yeah, so if you want to support the show, check it out. If you want to support the show, but don't have the money to do so, just liking and commenting as usual really goes a long way. So thanks for checking it out. Uh, back to the video. Roy Orbison walks inside my house and sits down on my couch. Presently, I say, perhaps you would like to see my cling film. By all means. I can see his eyes through his trademark dark glasses and I have no idea if he is merely being polite or if he genuinely has an interest in cling film. You never know. It's a possibility anyone could have an obsessive interest in cling film. I bring it from the kitchen. All the rolls of it. <laughs> There's so many. I have a surprising amount of cling film, I say with a nervous laugh. Roy merely nods. Hmm, yes. Ah, true, true, quite right. Got a good point there. I estimate I must have nearly a kilometer in the kitchen alone. As much as that, he says in surprise. So, mind you, people do not realize how much is on each roll. I bet that with a single roll alone, I could wrap you up entirely. Roy Orbison sits impassively like a monochrome Buddha. My palms are sweaty. I will take that bet, says Roy. If you succeed, I will give you tickets to my new concert. If you fail, I will take Jetta as a lesson to you not to speak boastfully. He's like a cling film turtle stealing sensei. I nod. So then, if you will please stand. Roy stands. Commence. I start at the ankles and work up. I am like a spider binding him in my gossamer web. I do it tight with several layers. Soon, 
Roy Orbison stands before me, completely wrapped in cling film. The pleasure is unexampled. You are completely wrapped in cling film, I say, if it wasn't obvious. You win the bet, says Roy, muffled. Now unwrap me, not for several hours. Ah. I sit and admire my handiwork for a long time, so as not to make the ordeal unpleasant for him. We make small talk on topical subjects. Roy, somewhat muffled. <laughs> At some point, I must leave him to attend to Jetta's needs. When I returned, I find he has hopped out of my house, still wrapped in cling film. The loss leaves me broken and pitiful. He never calls. He sends no tickets. The police come and reprimand me. Jetta is taken away, although I get her back after a complicated legal process. <laughs> There's only one thing that can console me. A certain dream. A certain vision. It always starts the same. Wow. That was unexpectedly riveting. What a story. I would love to continue, but we have more websites to get through. If you guys want to see more of Roy Orbison wrapped in cling film, uh, let me know in the comments below. I may just do a whole illustrated episode, if that's what you guys are into. I won't judge. Here we are at hritsu.net. Is it? This is it. The whole thing. It kind of looks like he's jumping backwards. Does anyone else see that? Like he's move. He's walking backwards. What is this? GrandpaNoClothes.com. What is this? Uh, BeOnlineB.com. Neon Bible. Oh, oh, what? Wow, I think this is a music video, but I can't play it. <laughs> ah, I think that's like a band. Wow, what an incredible experience. Like this, there's quite a bit of work gone into this. Look at this. Very cool. Okay. I look like BarackObama.com. Wow. You sure do. Okay, so there's a net neutrality notice here. Keep the internet weird. Love Barack uh, Trevor. This guy. <laughs> Who clearly looks exactly like Barack Obama. Wait. Or was it this guy? Looks exactly like Barack Obama. I can't tell. Hi, my name's Trevor, and I look like Barack Obama. I've had lots of people stop me on the streets, ask me about taxes and healthcare and things like that, and I thought I'd create a website to clarify that I am, in fact, not Barack Obama. Please note, one, I am not Barack Obama. We just look alike. Two, we are in no way related, to the best of my knowledge. Three, I am not the President of the United States. So please, if you see me on the street, don't come up to me asking if I'm Barack Obama. I'm not. He has bodyguards and dresses better. <laughs> If you're walking down the street and you think you see Barack Obama, wait! Do not go up to him, because it just might be me. I'll have more in here later. Thanks. Really? That's it? Oh, no, 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 there's more. Re the resemblance. The resemblance is not only skin deep. <laughs> well, it better be deeper than that, because... Uh... We may have non-physical similarities. Barack wanted to be president. I have wanted to be president. Barack used to live in Chicago. I live in Chicago. Barack went to college. I went to college. Barack was a senator. I was a petrol leader in the Boy Scouts. I realized I read that as petrol instead of patrol. But then there are many physical similarities, of course. We're both approximately the same height, different by only a few inches. <laughs> Our hair is about the same length. <laughs> Though he curls his hair so it's hard to tell. <laughs> Let's look at our faces. Overall, our faces are about the same. Same number of eyes, noses, ears. Well, let's look deeper. Let's look at the facial structure. All right, so we've got some squares. Ooh. Ooh, look at those squares. Look at how similar. I drew all sorts of lines all over the image to make it look like facial recognition stuff. Notice how similar the lines are. It's not just a coincidence. We really look alike. I gotta be honest, those lines do look very similar. Definitely. Differences, all right. I can't tell any. I, I can't see any. So let's see if Barack and I are different in some ways. For example, one, while both of us are half white, Barack's other half is black, but my other half is also white. <laughs> 
contact. Please note again, I'm not Barack Obama. You can contact him here. Is that White House? Also, I'm available to appear and impersonate Barack at the following. Birthday parties, bar mitzvahs, bachelor slash bachelorette parties, weddings. Imagine how cool it would be if Barack showed up at your wedding. Now he sort of can. All fields are optional. I will not post any of your information anywhere on the internet. Hi, I run a YouTube channel called Join In. I've always wanted Barack to be on my show just briefly to say hi and say I'm cool and stuff. I would love it if you wanted to appear in my YouTube video. Maybe if you just wanted to send a video saying, hi, join it. This is Barack. You're cool and stuff. Thanks, join it. I'll keep you guys updated. And lastly, we have a website called Baby Cakes. Babycakes.com. This is my personal website for my cat. Baby cakes and friends. Animal lovers will understand. This domain is not for sale. Baby cakes businesses. Don't worry about the trademarks issue because this site is non commercial. And this domain is not for sale. And that's probably baby cakes. Uh, this is the whole website. These little links up here are to share baby cakes onto that website. Share it onto your Facebook. Share it onto your Twitter. Share it onto your MySpace. Very cool, very cool website. Nice cat. I'll, uh, I'll see you tomorrow.